last week on the strong box and she has no idea what she wants from life but that's what she's saying she's just getting that feeling now and if she loses then she's built up all these expectations i don't think she has i think she's just been channeling her energy and i think she would be fine if she lost i agree medium hi what would you do at 25 grand open a salon set up a new recording studio maybe put a deposit on a flat could be nothing you know The final challenge is only hours away, and the housemates are packing. It's only a little while till everyone goes back home. One of them the winner of the contents of the strong box. I can't believe it. Tomorrow, I'll be back on the job site, swinging a hammer. Even if I win. That's where I'll be. Until I figure things out about me. Uh, it's been. You know those plants only flower after bushfire? That's this. And that's me. And you can't just take Justin's bed. That's not fair. What, what if Aaron wanted to get away from Selena? It does no <laughs> evidence. What will I miss? Um, actually quite a lot. I think I've slightly changed since I came here. You know, I feel a bit happier, more independent, and, I don't know, maybe a bit nicer. I'm going to miss Rona, and I'm going to miss Charles. I think it's important how you behave, you know, both when you're up and down, because life's not just about you. Correct. Erin wins. I need my ears, okay? We'll put cotton wool in them. Yeah, it looks better in real life, you know, set on the plan. The construction's really good. What's been good about this? Free food. Got some killer songs written. Still a chance to win. Bad things. The food was ordinary. No one here to appreciate my music. And I might not win. And if I don't win, Stupid. Stupid. So is your brother retarded? I know I've been a bit painful lately. Um, this whole band thing really pissed me off. And I know you're not musos, so you can't really understand. Well, sorry, okay? You, you know what's been good is that I'm really quite happy that I'm going to do well at my high school exams. <laughs> How nerdy is that? <laughs> it's been like study camp, just with insane um, distractions. You know? But, um, you know, it's good though, because, you know, I really don't care if I don't win. You know, I'm here, um, I'm healthy, um, you know, I've made new friends, I'm ahead of my studies, and I've learned to cook. Ladies, watch out. <laughs> Um, yeah, and you know, I'm still going to pull out the big stops to win. So. What if we, uh... Just don't touch it. Better than spending ten weeks at home. Marginally. Did you see this coming? Mm -hmm. Hi, 
everyone. Welcome to your final challenge. Take a seat. We've appraised your scores. At the moment, the margin between all of you is very close. So close that this challenge will decide the winner of the Strongbox prize. But first, Veronica has a few words. Well, congratulations. I know each of you have been taken out of the comforts of your families, your friends and routine you've had. You've been placed in this house for 10 weeks with people who are perfect strangers. You've had to learn about each other's strengths, their weaknesses and maybe a little bit about your own. I'm certain that you're going to take something positive home with you all. I'm so proud of each and every one of you, so good luck. Okay, this is your final challenge and it will decide who wins the prize. We can assure you that there is a prize and that it is worth winning. In the envelopes are your instructions for your final challenge. Are you ready? Begin. The final challenge. Each housemate must stand and explain who they think should win the strong box and why. After each turn, the others vote on whether they agreed with the argument. Hand up if they agreed with the argument. Hand down to disagree. Housemates can put their hands up three times. The person who provides the best argument and gets the most number of hands in the air wins the strong box. We don't care who starts, so when you're ready. Well, hi, I'm Runa. Look, you guys are all special. Um, the fact that we're all here neck and neck in this final challenge means we're all winners. But, you know, I think... I think Selena should win. Because she's real. She says what she thinks. What you see is what you get. She's smart, she won the last challenge, but most of all, she deserves it. She's working out what she wants from life, and I think all the rest of us know what we want. I think she could use the prize. That's all. Who thinks this is a good argument? Two votes, Rona. Well, that's hard to beat, but <clears throat> I think Charles should win. All of us had our ups and downs, but Charles, he's really proven himself smart over the challenges. And he's also the most consistent between the challenges. And he only lost his temper once, and that was with me. And who can blame him? He's been tough, right, Adam? But fair, right, Adam? And he's going back to school, and I think that's brave. I mean, he can use the prize on whatever he wants to do. And I hope he takes on the right path. So. Who thinks this is a good argument? Two votes Rona, two votes Erin. I think Adam should win. He's made such a song and dance about winning. I think we should just give it to him. Let's face it. Knowing the music industry is tough and he probably won't make it. So, this could be his only highlight in life. I say, let him have it. Who thinks this is a good argument? Two votes Rona, two votes Erin, two votes Selena. I agree with Selena. I think I should win. Not because I won't make it as a performer, because I will. But because I'm focused. I'll put 100% into this competition, just like I put 100% into my music. And I know I've rubbed some of you up the wrong way, and you know I'm sorry, but this is a competition, 
and it's about life and life is about being focused and I think I have that and that's why I think I should win. Who thinks that this is a good argument? Guys. Adam. Adam! We'll continue. That's not fair. No, it's, it's okay. Um, I don't know who should win. I guess we all should, but um, then again, maybe none of us should. You know, we've all had our Adam moments, and we've all spat the dummy, not as many times as Adam. <laughs> but um, I don't know what the prize is, so I don't know if I deserve it or if any of us do. But I wouldn't change the time we've had. It's been a great time, a learning time. Do I want the prize? Sure. Would I be upset if any of you won it? No way. If I had to choose who I wanted to have it, I'd have to say Rona, because I know that her heart was broken just recently and that might help get your mind off it. But that's the only reason. You know, he's all great. I love you all. And who agrees with this argument? The winner of the strong box is Charles. Now, I'm sure you've all been thinking about this for the last 10 weeks. The thing is this. We had five prizes individualised, one to suit each of you. Why don't you see what you've won? Oh my god. Well? It's, it's $40,000 to any university I get into. <laughs> and two tickets to BG for five nights. Oh, <laughs> that's important. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> You guys don't go home with nothing but happy memories. Okay. Oh, wow. Cool. Congratulations. Thank you. Oh, awesome. Selena. Thanks. Wow. Thank you. Well done. That's good. Thank you. <laughs> Selena.